one foot in front of the other Stepping into the here and now I'm not sure just where I'm going But I will get there anyhow We are at Martin's Fork uh, Campground in uh, Cumberland Gap and we have with us today a special treat. This is our recording, the Gabriel Outdoor Cooking Show. <laughs> We're making pizza. Oh, you're making pizza today. Okay, yeah, now. Get a, get a close up of that. <laughs> <laughs> this is the messy part. Okay, so can you can you narrate what you're doing right now at this moment? Uh, at this point, I'm making the pizza dough. And I'm making two pizzas, so I have to do this twice. Now, did you buy boxed pizza dough or? Well, this is, yeah, so this is Betty Crocker pizza dough. Okay. So just add water, a little bit of oil. I did. I already, I already put in the oil. Oh, yeah, show. Yeah. oh okay. You have to show every it's ingredient. Olive oil. Okay. <laughs> olive oil. I'm like, that okay, so you now. added <laughs> water. I have to saute these in a bit. Yeah. Is, mm -hmm. is there a method wow. to uh, <laughs> kneading the dough? Uh, oh, okay. Get enough water in it oh, okay. the first time. It looks a little red. So you're going to have to keep, uh, yeah, keep doing this. Yeah, I put um, yes. chipotle's in it. Uh, it. I made a chipotle hummus. It's kind of hard when you mm, have a, just a tiny little surface. I tried to say I was watching this YouTube yes. video and everyone was yes. in the comments oh, reading about that. this avocado. Oh, there's yeah. videotaking uh, going on. I haven't tried it, so I don't I know. I have to say, this one's like, not all organic. Like I had to get yeah. pre-made stuff. I started making like my own um, uh, salad dressing, chipotle salad sauce. dressing. Sauce and yeah. stuff like that. So I thought, Look how many well, pepperoni What else can I make? Wow, he likes pepperoni. Oh my gosh, yeah. You know what, and I said, why would you carry so much weight? He said, well, he's going to share with everybody. So when he's done, he could so we all get the pepperoni. Amount, perfect <laughs> amount of oil. likes to carry, yep. or, you know, food weight. Yeah, that's absolutely right. Uh -huh. Yeah, food weight's good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Gear weight's good. <laughs> it works good with honey. You can and honey. Yeah, I've done you know, honey. He's gonna share. Olive oil. Gouda cheese. I've even, even done Gouda? stuff for Gouda? Gouda? Ooh, ooh, yummy. Is that for the pizza? So, ooh, yeah. Yeah. so you don't do yeah. mozzarella? Oh, or like sunscreen or something? Wrapped you know, it's like so good. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so this is a gourmet pizza. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah. Well, for me, free to yeah. And now, uh, why are those uh, sliced red so peppers do, in the food, in the it? tin cup yeah. there? Because, because I have to saute them, yeah, but I needed exactly. a cutting board. So it's gonna be like for probably the do like dough. all yeah. like most of it at once, or so, so it's like whenever you make it. Yeah, I've heard I put them in there until they, once I have everything you know, pre ready to go. Uh -huh. Then I'll saute um, the peppers, and then I'll do the dough, and we'll be all set. Great. And then at what point do you put the spices? Which there's just dehydrated. Garlic, <laughs> paprika. <laughs> when do you put that on? Like um, once right I get with the, the pizza sauce? sauce on. So I'll put okay. the dough in, and the pizza okay. sauce, and then those, and then the pepperoni, and then the peppers. And now, why does the pizza sauce look like that? <laughs> it's reconstituting. It's reconstituting. It's, oh, it's explain that, please. <laughs> so that was dried over 135 degrees until it became leather, and then I peeled it off the dehydrator. Wow. Mm. Okay. And we have to... And we have dough. I can't wait till he starts flipping it. In the yeah, <laughs> I'm waiting for that. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. How I'll do that. <laughs> so, how long have you? How yeah. long have you been a gourmet outdoor cook? Uh, probably four years. That's when I started going ultra light, and then I was jealous of other people's food, and so I said I was going to take fresh stuff and uh, make stuff that people would be jealous of. <laughs> <laughs> well, you certainly have an audience here who mm -hmm. our stomachs are growling. We're in anticipation of how this is going to turn out. That's crazy. That was good. Last night I had a Mexican uh, bowl, so I had brown rice. <laughs> oh, we missed the oil in the pan part. I'm sorry, cameraman faux pas. Camera woman faux pas here. I'm just waiting for it to catch and then we just cut all the way. And I think it's about to be a few hot. Wow. The edges were slightly brown. No. Mm. You didn't see that. It was what? The uh, for, for, for the fire to catch in the bottom. Yeah. So you know now, now, what is that cube there? That's a, I forgot the chemical, it's an esbit. Esbit? Yeah. 
Can you get that in most camping stores? Uh -huh. Okay. Okay, now we have. Yeah. Oh, you remember the audience here observing? There's John, Ben. That's it. Gabefoodgoodfood.com. Is <laughs> <laughs> that still a little frozen? Yeah, well, it's still dried out. Or dried so out? It's still a little Does bit it help watery. if you put it on top of there? No? Okay. It's almost, it's it's almost done. Water thing. Okay. Pizza sauce. Yummy. Mm -hmm. Where's the mushrooms? I left them at home. <laughs> they don't cook very well, so I have to no? saute them like this. and ah. I have to slice them really thin, and it's too much work to slice everything. What yeah. about pre-cooking mushroom and freezing? And... No? Okay. Do it fresh. Got there. Yes, let's see what other people are mentioning. I, 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 I have white cheddar, yeah, I was. Mm -hmm. queso, yeah. north, I just didn't uh, want the weight. and I put in my freeze dried uh, my my freezer bag in in here and let it you know get get um soak yeah soak get thick and then I added some tuna that and mixed it good. so there's a lot of flavors in my oh, dinner. Okay. <laughs> very good. <laughs> And Miss Calzone, what did you have for dinner? Um, I had an apple. I had a sandwich that I found in my bag. I don't know how long that goes. Um, and then I have tuna that I will be finishing my dinner with at some point. Oh, if you don't get any pizza, right? If, yeah. Yeah. Okay, now we've checked in with Kathy. She had spaghetti. For, yes, with spicy. Yeah. Spaghetti, yeah. Yeah. I, I leathered up that sauce, you know, and then um, <laughs> rolled it on out, just like a fruit roller, and mixed it up. Had sausage, pre-made sausage, well, like I made it, and then, you know, because I killed the pig, and then, <laughs> yeah, I did it all. Yeah. And, and Carl, what are you eating for dinner tonight? Eating um, <laughs> Jack Bart chili. Oh, how, how's that taste? It's actually pretty good. I added um, I added some cheddar cheese and Fritos oh. to it. Show your freezer pack. Yeah, good thinking. Oh, yes, they made these lovely packets yeah. of hummus. Wow, very clever. Very clever. Yeah, that was supposed to be my lunch today, but I didn't eat it. So I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> and tell us about how you iron the chuck. Yeah, so these are freeze pop oh, okay. eggs. You, you take a freeze pop uh -huh. and you dump out the juice or eat it, whatever, okay. and uh, wash it out. And you can use it for all kinds of stuff. But this time I put hummus in there. And then you take a regular iron and you can seal up to the end again. That's very, very ingenious. It is. Wow. I'm going to steal that idea. Because <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> yeah, brilliant. So, let's see what Gabriel's doing. Oh, well, here's <laughs> he's slicing the, the cheese. Now, this is Gouda cheese. Yeah. Gourmet. <laughs> gourmet cheese for this very gourmet pizza on the fire. Awesome. Brands of hummus out there. Yeah. I'm obsessed. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yeah. It's slightly warmer that last mile. Yeah. Okay. Well, at that point, I was thinking that we, were, we missed it, our first return. Oh, yeah. Because I, I thought it was going to be sooner. I don't know. Mm -hmm. You saw some pretty good sights today. Didn't you guys go to the. Yeah, we, I have to do that tomorrow. Uh -huh. All in the delivery. Yeah, oh, my God, I work on that. <laughs> delivery timing. <laughs> okay, so we see the dough has been molded to the pan. Yeah. I'm just like day hiking. He's now applying the sauce. Applying. He's applying the sauce. Wait, what do you do with sauce? You, you spread it. You know, that, I like it. You apply it. Yeah. <laughs> What's the correct wording? That's correct. That's perfect. Cooking, cooking term for applying the sauce. Apply the sauce. The idea is I need to make two of these, so I need to make sure I don't use that too much. More than half, right? Yeah, oh, true. yeah. Yeah. Of course, there is pizza without sauce. It's sauceless pizza. Yeah. Very true. Very fascinating. Yeah, that sauce looks rich. Yeah. I think I can smell it from here. Wow. Excellent. What will you do for us after dinner, Gabriel? I'm going to make creme brulee. Yeah, I was going to do it in the oven with uh, some uh, foil reflector. He almost looks serious. <laughs> I'm tired. I like from the way. Is it spice yeah, time? Spice time okay. Half of the spice. You make a great producer. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Okay, now <laughs> tell us what you're sprinkling again so on this the... is garlic, onion, red onion, and uh, uh, not paprika, it's um, mm -hmm. red pepper, pepper. cayenne. Cayenne. Oh, yeah, it's not it's freeze Oh, okay. But you can purchase? Yeah. You can purchase? Actually, there is, I think there are photos. Where, so where do you purchase that? I got my Oh, really? Oh. Kroger's going to pay for this. Yeah. <laughs> they just got free advertising. Yeah. <laughs> They're going to be a sponsor. I do all my shopping at Kroger. <laughs> Sometimes I go to the Newport branch, but the new one in Oakley, right by Crossroads, is just phenomenal. <laughs> Moscow. <laughs> I'd like to do this them. all Look organic so, uh, yeah, there. Money. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how organic you can get with pepperoni. Mm. I don't know. And, and obviously for the vegetarians, you can leave off the pepperoni. Mm. <laughs> vegetarians are <laughs> me. <laughs> Let's see if he actually does. Yeah. <laughs> How much extra weight do you think this adds to your pack? Um, <laughs> you know, not compared to what I normally take, it's pretty light. So I normally bring like steak and fresh <laughs> eggs and bacon. And, yeah. and this is a lot of dried stuff that I mix up. Yes, we, food just we tastes yeah. really good outside. When you cook it outside, consume it outside. Okay, hey, set your timer. Five minutes. Yeah. Five minutes. So the pizza took about five minutes to cook? Yep. Is it done? <laughs> it is done. Oh! Well, no it's not. It's not done yet. Balsam awesome arm. It's close. Yeah. Yeah. Give it another few on the fire. Oh. Let's look at the bottom. Uh, we do that first. Yeah. Set this off. Looks beautiful. Oh, 
It's like as crispy as the second one is going to be. Yeah. But. Ooh, bottom looks good. They like. So the second one's going to be more crispy than this one because the fuel is running out. This one then is done. All right, anyone want pizza? There we go. Pizza served. For Gabriel's outdoor back wilderness cooking class. Backcountry wilderness cooking class. There, I got it right. Put one foot in front of the other. Stepping into the here and now I'm not sure just where I'm going But I will get there anyhow I got this far with no direction I follow my nose to where I stand My heart's still strong and I know I'll make it And sit right down in the promised land Sister, come and walk beside Beside me until our pathways do divide. Nothing much but love to give you, even less help I'd have. Let's check in with Sonia. So, you have steak here on the fire. Yes, our viewers would be very interested in how uh, you got this going. So, can you yeah. tell us about the steak there on the fire? I, I get some steak and cut it into little cubes, marinate it, put it in the freezer and it's in my tag. Keep it on ice until it's ready to go. Look at my mic, it's going to work. And by the time you get done, you have to spawn out and eat ready. Wow. That's, that's a wonderful, meaty alternative. Wait, I heard it's super exciting. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell you're taking notes. I think this would be like a YouTube sensation. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I think we should. And, so, and then now, yeah. And just get, getting people ready for the next episode, which will be Calzone. Calzone. Uh, we're interested in all things food, camping all things food. food. Yes. Yeah, just to get it to hydrator. It's your, it's your camping friend. You get to eat well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm not talking about the camera. <laughs> you know your ingredients. You're not buying that mountain. <laughs> Can we say that on YouTube? <laughs> People come and walk beside me to the pathways to divide. Nothing much but love to give you, and even less help how to hide. People come and walk beside me. Give you. Love